Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. You're back with Dak Dak for some more seven days to die. We've got a day and a half before Horde Day. Uh, what could I do in preparation? A cement mixture. Engines, machine parts. Oh, my word. I have quite a few machine parts. Uh... Let's get an engine. What else do we need? Four springs and some iron. Let's get them in there. And we've got loads of iron. I can make a cement mixer. Do da. Actually, I can make a couple of them. Let's make a few cement mixers. Uh, don't need anything else from there. We needed. Damn it. Damn it. We need more springs. More of them. How many can we actually make? Engines. Fool. Let's make a few more. Yeah, because then I can start cooking up some cement. I do realise that you can't cook cement, but you know what I mean. Good. I actually had the right goggles on for once. How long are you guys going to take? Quite a while, I expect. Yeah. Yeah, that's a slight problem. <clears throat> um, What should we do in the meantime, then? Oh, yeah, you don't press that button anymore. God damn it. Uh, I might dig more of the moat out. So I want to stick around base for a bit. Don't know why I went this way around. Yeah. Let's dig more of the motor. I don't know why I can't do it from here. Oh yeah. Last stream. We got ourselves a mini bike. Hey dude. Do you want to be the first death in today's stream? Wow. That stutter. Yeah boy. I'd whistle but Luna's going to come running if I do. So nope. By then. Right, yeah. Let's start digging this out. What mods have you got on you, Bunker Buster? That's fine for now. Now, this is going to absolutely destroy my stamina. But luckily, I've not got that much of this to dig out. Let's just swap the knife a minute so I can be placing them down. I think I'm actually going to leave it like that for now. We're not too bothered about them jumping across. It's mainly just to stop the uh, the bulk of them running straight to my door. If they uh, happen to come this way around. Oops. I actually thought I'd uh, have finished mining it there. No, we didn't. So what's the plan for today then? We've got, like I say, the Horde at night coming around very shortly. I would like to get some cement up and running. So I could uh, potentially upgrade the very front tower. Make that more defensive. What you do? I'm actually just explaining. It was weird that you came in as uh, I was saying that. Oh, I've not got any drink on me. What a fool. Uh, just getting ready for the second horde night, yeah. Ooh, hello dudes. How you doing? Let's walk across there. Just beat some face in. Why not? <clears throat> Come on. Bye then. Can we get some more headshots? Or exploding headshots even. I think you're dead. Yeah, you're dead. Come on. You're missing out on the beating over there. You don't want to miss out on the beating. Any more for any more? Mum. Alright. Let's continue, shall we? Wait, where am I going? I want to paint more of this as well. And I do think I'm actually going to change all the white tiles underneath. I don't know yet. I don't know. It's going to be a glamorous booby trap. <clears throat> it's going to be very pretty. 
Yeah, Horde Knight's still up onto 16, but I'm not being funny. I have thought about putting it up to 64. I know that's risky, considering how badly my last Horde Knight went. But it just make it that bit more interesting. This is about to break. There we go. You know what? Let's repair you, repair you, repair you. Screw it, repair everything. I've got the repair kits for now. We might as well. The sooner we get off of this concrete bit, the better. It's just when... I can quite easily make more of my towers at this point. So, I think turning it up to be even more difficult only seems fair. Although, I have, I've literally just started crafting four cement mixers. So we should be able to get some cement in fairly soon. And that would be wonderful. Your dirt. What mods have you got? Fair enough. Let's dig all these top tiles around. And then I know I can dive in. That, I just want to make this a tiny bit more defensive. Not looking for this to be any sort of like Horde Knight base. I just want it to A, look prettier and B, not have zombies try and dig through the bottom. Because if I'm going down into the mine at some point, which I may do in a little bit, uh, I don't want them coming down there with me. My god, the stamina. I should... What do you think you're doing over there? Uh, I should just go and get a drink. No, it's fine. So these goddamn steel tools annihilated my stamina. I'm not complaining. The fact that we've got steel tools by day 20 already is kind of ridiculous in my opinion. Alright, we can build all of uh, this wall around the top there. It's a very short storyline for now, which... Um, I understand it's like just come out, so you kind of expect that. Oh, she's getting closer. She's going to die then. Very short story, but I wasn't playing it for the story anyway. I don't play survival games for the story. You play them to survive. As I mentioned to you on Discord, the spiders. Oh, my word. I nearly cried. Actually cried. Hello there, Adam. How are you doing, dude? Um, I was actually very tempted to uh, stream some Grounded instead of Seven Days to Die. I mean, it's not like I've, um, I'm behind with the recording for this anyway, for YouTube, so. But now, I, I like Grounded. I just started building a nice small square base. I just got to this little robot dude that you can give uh, upgrade chips to, so you can learn even more complex building materials. Uh, building materials, like base building abilities. It's cool. Oh, I got attacked, but I, um, the ants seem to bug through your wall at the minute. So I kind of like tried to smash one to get rid of it. To which, obviously the worker ant then summons more worker ants. And then they summon fighter ants later on. I ended up with a full scale war happening <laughs> just outside my base. One of them must have accidentally attacked a ladybug. Um, and by the time I went out, it had killed nearly all of the ants, bar the last few. So I finished off the ladybug and took the victory. And then looted everything from the ants. But no, it's a, it's a dead fun game. Except it's just the spiders. When I saw one at a distance, it's like, I can do this. I can do this. And then it saw me and started sprinting at me. So it's just like, oh my god, no, run away. And as I'm running away, there was another one in front of me. I very, very nearly cried. <laughs> oh, it was horrible. I did look into the arachnophobia mode. You can have different scales of it. So the first one like removes the noises that they make and takes like their fangs away, I think. The next one takes 
their legs away. So it's just a floating torso. And then the next one takes, uh, takes away like the texture. So it's just like this floating white ball thing with no legs coming at you. No. I think instead I'm just going to try and uh, make some better armor, get a bow, and maybe stand up on one of the blades of grass and wreck them. But they tip the blades of grass, don't they? So that probably won't work. I don't know. Yeah, you would have died laughing. I would have died crying. It would have been brilliant. They're so realistic looking. And it, it wouldn't be as bad if they were like a normal size. But it like filled my entire screen. It's just... Oh, I wasn't I wasn't happy, bunny. I wasn't impressed with them. Oh dear. Oh dear. But yeah, that's grounded. I've also been really enjoying playing uh, No Man's Sky. I just got to the... I want to call it the Crucible, but it's not. It's like a big... Uh... It, it, they are utterly terrifying. Um, it's like a big thing in the middle of space. A big uh, starship docking, whatever you want to call it, where... It shows you all other people that's online. You can all go and do quests together and whatever. It seems quite fun. Put you guys in there. I can be pressing that instead. Uh, I wanted to get some drinks. I have some tea. I wanted to get some food as well, looking at it. We're a, a little bit low. I guess I'm eating this meat stew for now. Any of you finished yet? We have two. And on my uh, raft playthrough, not to uh, spoil anything yet. I mean, there's only two of you watching at the minute, so y you know that I'm recording raft. Um, I'm probably in front of where we are now. Already? Right, I need to get making cement. Realistically? I need more of these, don't I now? What do we need for another forge? Stone. Right. Yup, yup. Um, leather. Duct tape and short iron pipes. I can make a forge. I want to get four going preferentially, so give me six of them, and I've only got five glue. Well, fair enough then. Uh, duct tape. Then I better make more forges from that. <clears throat> that and I need more stone, honestly. I've not exactly got loads. What were we doing with this one? I know I was smelting the bullets down. The ones that I don't need. I think we're good for clay now, honestly. Let's get a stack of iron in there. Probably help if I took some wood out to actually get the stack smelting. Anyway. Uh, what do we want? Just give me 40. And then we can get that one going. <clears throat> yeah, I'm going to leave them bullets in there smelting. We've got another one right there. I've not got any extra anvils or anything. It is a shame that... Whoops. For cement I need... Oh, just stone. Cool. Um... You know what, give me the 81 for this one. I think we're going to need it. Over an hour's worth of smelting. Might be a bit much. Yeah, I think that's a bit much. Put the wood back. How are we doing in there? 
Have I got any more ammo that I need to get rid of? Them 12. I think I can hear walking around. Yeah. Yeah, only one of you. Why them? Absolutely failed that. Whoop. I'll leave the chicken alone. We'll leave the chicken alone. All it's trying to do is cross the road. Haha. <laughs> uh. Anyway. So yeah, more stone means I've got to go in the mine more, which we're not going to be able to do that before night time. Gives me another cement mixer. At least I'm getting there with all this stuff. Right, definitely no more ammo that we want to get rid of. And no. In that case then. Let me throw another stack or well, a full stack of clay in here with this. Let's get the bullet casing smelted up. And past that point, we can just leave it to smelt away. Happy days. You can make me some cement. It's not going to be much for now. Um, what am I missing? Oh, the small stones. Fool. Wait. Fool. Can only make one. Yeah, I've not got enough duct tape. There we go. That's fine. Right, all of this rubbish can go back. Uh, put you away. Put you away. And we're good at that. Smeltables, you can go away. Probably need to get some more food going. I think we're going to start getting hungry soon. How long's that forge got left? Another 40 seconds. But it's not like I'm going to be smelting anything else in the forge right now. So let's go back out and continue reinforcing the moat wall. I thought that chicken was an intruder then. Let's turn this off. Oh. I actually forgot they ran during the night, believe it or not. So we did all the top there. Let's try and get more of this done. In fact, if I crouch, they'll probably not be able to hear me. And we can put that there. Good. You know, I've just said I need stone. So why don't I go into the mine for a bit? We've got a few hours to kill overnight anyway. There we go. Oh, the sky's going a tinge of red, ready for tomorrow. The blood moon's coming. Yeah, let's go in the mine. Screw the outside walls. Well, that's probably not advisable, is it? I still need to get rid of all this. That's going to take an absolute age with them having 15,000 health each. But anyway, uh, I'm going to keep these blocks on me. In the morning, we're going to the Horde Bay straight away. You can go there. What shall I have you smelt him? Why not get some of this lead going? Excuse me. Probably shouldn't have shot at him. But we don't seem to have had anybody else coming out for us, so... Yeah, yeah let's get some lead going in this one. <clears throat> uh, just want to load more of this. 
And yes, I do that every single time. I split resources. Turn you on. Let's get the lead smelting in that one. And... You're doing me some men. I need like one more. You know what? We don't need the clay in there right now. I do tend to just throw all of these things where I know we're going to be needing them smelted. I can't throw any more in there. Eh, they'll be fine like that. They can go in there. We've cleared that out. No end. Ammo? Bullet casings. Why have I still got lead on me? There you go. I mean, we've not got much in the way of uh, lead, but... It's a start, I guess. In fact, I'm probably going to want to turn you off. You've not really got that much more to smell, and I don't really want to waste the wood. Eventually, I'll just use my forges for absolutely whatever I want, but for now, I want to try and keep some sort of order to them. Um, drinks. I have no coffee. I do have the... Uh, Excuse me, the blackstrap coffee, but... No. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Right. Oh, I just picked up a frame block. Where the hell did I take it from? There. Thank you. Right, I do want to go back to the top, and I want to work my way down from the roof here. And you can see, <clears throat> we are sealed in from the inside out. Drink one of them. Shame it's not a coffee, but never mind. We're crouching, so we're nice and quiet. We don't get much stone doing this, but... I'd rather get the metal while I'm getting a bit of stone. Until I get real desperate for concrete, and then it would just be a flat-out stone grind. We are out of stamina already. You know what? I think you need the ergonomic grip. We're not mining stone anyway. Should reduce the stamina usage a bit more. In fact, yeah, that is loads better. Right, is that fully mined out there? I hope it is. a couple of them down. Let's try and mine out all the way under it just to see what's happening. Let's see how much further this comes under the uh, the moat. I do hope it doesn't come under the ramp bit of it because then I'm going to have to build out all the ramp and I really don't want to have to build ramps out because it's a nightmare. You are actually joking me. You absolutely suck, madam. I literally just got down there. <sighs> screamers, ladies and gentlemen. Screamers. And now she runs around. Good. There's nobody else in there. You know what? I'm coming down to you. That's a proper scream. Did you summon a horde? I would have thought you did. Well, if nobody's coming running, screw it. Genius plays. Shut the door on your own face there. Back to the mine we go. Alright. Up. Up. 
it sucks that it burns through all my stamina getting back up here, but there wasn't much we could do about that. She just came at a dead unfortunate timing. Goddamn nightmare. I would turn my light off. Oh god, itchy shoulder. Um, but you really can't see anything if I do that. You know what, I'm going to take this one brick out here. And then when you actually tell what's happened. That's good. <clears throat> the sooner we can get away from the top bit of this, the happier I'll be. Which, that is going to take a massive time. And honestly, it's probably going to be a lot of time while I'm not recording. Doing mine work like this. Because it does tend to go on for absolutely ages. As me and Brittany found out. Out of stamina already. Steel tools are good for grabbing stuff, but... They destroy your stamina, and that's even with the level of sex rex that I've got already. This goes under the wall, doesn't it? Really? I just get tired of hearing him panting. <clears throat> this is where I need like proper coffee production. Which, we're not actually far off, but... I have got a feeling this is altering my moat. No! Come on. Let's dig straight under this wall. No, it's not caused the problem yet. I do think I'm going to dig this out though and block it in. Make it a bit more fortified. Please don't keep going that way, Iron. I mean, I've not got to mine it. But I don't want to waste resources. See, at the minute, they're liable of just digging straight down. I was stuck for a minute there. Uh, they're liable of digging down through them out and trying to come down and round. Which is why I want to see what the extent of this all is. It's looking pretty extensive. That's lead. No, it's not. It looked like lead. It looked like it had a touch of red in it there. Really, game. <laughs> Lucky this isn't the horde base, so it won't be a problem come horde night. Yeah, they could quite easily just punch down there. And then the straight into my base, basically. Luckily, the zombies don't always act that smart. Good for me, really. If they're any smarter, I'd be screwed. Well, that's why the horde base is being designed like it is. They can't dig down into any of that part of it. Yes, they can smash the walls and try and dig straight through the stone tower, but that doesn't seem very bright to me. So, up and off the floor is probably going to be the better option. You know what? I might just break the roof out above me. Yeah. That'll give us some more fortification. That I can actually get some stone. And I don't think it's going into the floor of the moat. So we're good for now. <clears throat> I mean, I guess the smartest way would be to break all of this out as we've dug it out. Just to add in the... Uh, Durability again back under it all and it'd stop any collapses hopefully I 
I thought that was coal for a minute. It's dead difficult, in my opinion, to tell what's coal and what's not. It's like coal's black. That's black to me. I mean, you can obviously tell if you've got coal by if you're gathering coal or not. No duh. But it just seems like there should be a bit more contrast between them. I don't know, this doesn't seem bad. It just depends how much further it goes to the left there. I'm still going to leave that wall in above us. No reason to take it out. It's just a waste of stamina and it can supply us with a bit more defence, I guess. Because it's bottlenecking them at the minute through this little opening that we've got. Although it's nearly morning, so we're probably going to be going back up soon. See what we've uh, got to work with. I've got like no cement or anything. Maybe we'll try and get some food ready because I am getting on the hungry side here. Although I guess that wall is in the way in the sense that I've got to keep digging under it now, but... Yes, fine. There's nothing above us, which is the main point. <clears throat> At least I've got a sense of uh, being complete and knowing that I've not missed any iron. Because even though there's this much, I don't want to waste resources. Why would I? Come on. That and we're definitely going to see if we can make any more coffee. Wasn't I having a problem with water last time? <clears throat> Boiled water. Although I smelted a load of the... Uh, smelted. I melted a load of the snow that I got. And turned it into murky water. Seems like that's the iron from that way. Oops. Nearly missed the wall. Alright, it seems like we've got all this top surface now. And it just goes down again. <clears throat> Let's have another drink so I can get the rest of this little plateau that we've got here, hopefully, before we go back up. And like I say, then we can see what we're doing. So it's 10 concrete to upgrade one block. So really, I'd at least like 70 concrete, uh, yeah, concrete mix before I went to the horde base. So that would mean I could upgrade all the front wall of it. Which would actually do so much. In fact, I should really have made some iron, vault, uh, iron vaults. Some... Um, what are they? Hatches. That's the one. Why could I not think of the word hatch? Stupid. Although, haven't I got some forged steel? I don't think I could make any vault ones yet. Although, that would be cool. Then they would try and get through the walls. Oh, ah. Uh, is it now? Oh, this stamina is just terrible. In fact, I've nearly broke this pick again. What the hell? I have broke this pick again. Jesus. I didn't realise we'd mined out quite that much. It's a bit on the ridiculous side, isn't it? In a good way, that is. Come on, get lost. Good God, man. It's taking forever. In fact, have I even got any, like, skill points? No, no skill points. Fair dues. I think that's enough mining for now. We've seen more of the extent of what we've got left to dig at. Down we go.